how to design a dipole antenna for 2.4 gigahertz and similarly we will add the sweep in the result of this antenna and we will discuss how the band is shifting with change in length and if we change in the radius of cylinder of this dipole so what will be the result affected after we will see if we change the input impedance so what effect will be occur on antenna result First of all, we will add some parameter so that we can add the sweep in the result of antenna. The radius of this dipole will be 1.5 millimeter. And length will be 62.46 millimeter you can add you can find the length for specific frequency you can use the macros concept for calculating the wavelength go to calculate and there is calculate wavelength from here you can adjust the operating frequency here is 2.4 gigahertz just press ok and you can see that for 2.4 gigahertz operating frequency the half wavelength will be 62.46 millimeter similarly if I want to make a dipole antenna for quarter wavelength I will choose this length we will see in lecture, next lecture Next is feed line value is 10 millimeter. Next is input impedance value which is 73 ohm. These are the parameter list of this dipole antenna. Now create a cylinder give it a name dipole radius define as R and the dipole length will be along z axis so define l by 2 similarly the material we can assign copper to this i am assigning pc perfect conductor and check the preview and press next is feed line Feed line basically the gap between the arms of this dipole. Radius will be same. Here change the length as a feed length value and similarly the material will be vacuum in another case when we, we have designed the dipole antenna for 0.9 gigahertz 
we use the subtract command and after that we added the discrete port by selecting the center point now in this case we will add the enter insert in this case we will insert using insert command and after that by using the edges of arms of an dipole we will create an port to this antenna in this case we will use a little different method press on dipole and here command insert and press this field line and press enter you can see that this has been inserted into it now I am going to assign a discrete port for this case I will pick the edges of one arm of antenna similarly I will pick the edges of another arm of antenna and go to simulation and assign discrete port here well I, I will assign the variable z which we have defined after the execution if if there is any problem in result we can use this inward direction press ok now you can check from here the port has been assigned now assign the frequency range we are going to resonate it by 2.4 gigahertz so I will choose from 1 to 5 gigahertz after that now add monitor field E field and far field just start simulation now check out the result far as a return loss I am going to mark it at minus 10 dB this band is operating through frequency now we will use a sweep to shift this to exactly 2.4 gigahertz in next part we will add sweep in length to shift it at the required frequency of operating 2.4 gigahertz and similarly we add the sweep in field line and radius and impedance of this dipole and we will discuss the parameter changes result changing in dipole antenna with respect to different parameters